So Amelia, but I need us to revise our thinking. Do you understand why the distribution was unfair? It doesn't matter that there was a given amount of students and each, and they received just one less sub. If you do the mathematical process, you will realize that you have, the, everyone is receiving less than one sub, but they're also really receiving less than, they're, they're not receiving equal parts of those parts of those subs. Because, Crystal, you had an O moment. Because um, they're not receiving the same amount of sub because since the denominators are different, there's different parts of a whole. Ah, okay. So now we're seeing how, I see I'm hearing a different strategy completely. For the whole time that we've been talking, about three, four minutes, we've been talking about division. Okay, and now we're seeing a direct correlation, a direct connection with a common denominator. Explain this a little bit more, Crystal, this common denominator, and how is it related to this division? Because it's, it's hard to um, see how to compare them because since they all have different denominators, um, they have different, a different total, and if you find common denominators, then all of the um, all of the totals are going to be the same, and then you're going to see which one has more of the total or less than the total. Um, I, think, I think that the common denominator is 40. Um, if you were to multiply them to find the common denominator, it will be easier, and the denominator could be 40 if you wanted to compare them. Okay, so now we have two different ways in comparing who got more or whether it was dis distributed equally. We have division, which was an operation we used, and we also used fractions with converting those denominators into like denominators. You have your hand up, Kaylees? For the second one, um, I got eight tenths, and if you use the strategy that Crystal did, if you um, um, find an equivalent, equivalent fraction for four fifths, if you multiply that times two, it'll give you eight tenths, and you can convert that into a decimal. Very good. Excellent. Uh, wonderful conversation.